to secondhand smoke increases the risk of heart disease and lung cancers in people who have never smoked in their lifetime. So, however, a study found that some non-smoking participants exposed for an hour to high THC marijuana in an unventilated room reported mild effects of the drug and few other studies showed that positive urine tests in the hours directly following exposure. So it suggests that not only direct exposure, indirect exposures can also harm people, especially our near and dear. So increased spread of infections is another major cause, just like the one which we have thought, HIV, HP, hepatitis. And not only this, the, the drugs that are misused can cause intoxication, which hinders judgment and increases the chance of ris risky behaviors, especially sexual abuse, and it may at times lead to illicit trafficking. So they can be a part of illicit tra trafficking. This way is not only observed only against drugs, but also against illicit trafficking. Human trafficking is one of the major problems that the world is facing. In 2016, one study said that almost 8,000 plus reported cases of human trafficking were there, but if we take up the statistics since 2016, the number has increased but not decreased. So every one of us should take the responsibility of addressing such problems. And uh, also, one more very risky uh, concern is motor vehicle accidents. The person who has taken drugs, he himself doesn't harm uh, himself. Okay, accident charity, koni kutipal vadapadte, on entire character. Okay, accident ki karnavaina vada to patu, karnavaina vada jail kwelta. Alla accident barn padan vada hospital barn vada out there. Hospital bill barn shlaka family ban padan. Okay, Atlanta okay, employee rakapode, karnikalu was a industry ban padan. At the end of the day, nation is also suffering. So, this kind of drug abuse can also, it has become one of the major reasons for motor vehicle accidents. So, in the Shaparu, can this addiction be treated successfully? The answer is yes. Yes, the addiction is a treatable disorder. Research on the science of addiction and the treatment of substance use disorders has led to the development of research-based methods that help people to stop using drugs and resume productive lives. This is called as recovery. And whether this can be cured, 